let's watch let's watch this video of the advice Judith Edoche, that's your Edoche's wife, gave to young ladies. Make sure you watch this video to the end and don't forget to drop a comment and subscribe to this channel. Subscribe, click on this subscribe below and then drop your comment. Watch this video. Girls, what of our, our girls that you know you go to school to to read, to gain the knowledge that will shape your life. You focus on being the playing the girlfriend role to your boyfriend in his flats, <laughs> probably because he's he's rich. They will carry you in front of Benz, and then you're the madam of a house, a student. You're about a 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. What you need as a young girl is to go and be playing wife role to another small boy that knows nothing. Come on. And then you see them. I'm talking to you if you're one of those girls. Their, their nails will be as, in, as long as this. Their lashes will almost get to their forehead. What are you trying to prove? What are you trying to look like? Like you're the best, you're the it girl. No, my love, you're not. You're not. That is you being distracted from what you were sent to school to do. If you're, if you're a young girl and you know you're not ready for anything in marriage, and you're working or maybe you're learning trading, please don't let peer pressure put you into what you cannot explain. Don't let peer pressure put you into what you might not be able to defend. Of course. Don't let it this. Don't destroy yourself with your own hands. Don't don't do it because Amaka is dating that boy and that boy just got Amaka iPhone 20 or got Amaka Samsung Galaxy or whatever. It is is meaningless. Once you have your life rising you into things, you have a friend that drives a Benz or a friend that lives in a flat and you, you're in, in one room and this friend is always telling you, ah, now you the door, now they did the door, others don't make a move. See, I can even link you up, you go get house tomorrow. Cut that relationship today. Exactly. Cut that relationship today. And I'll tell you how to do it. Because whatever we do, we have to apply diplomacy. Now, start by avoiding the person slowly. Don't do it once because most of these boys, some of them are far too, they are too gone. Now, you have listened to her. Now, she gave them advice because of one of most of the things we are seeing happening in campuses. You know, when you go to universities, you see uh, young ladies following after men, after their fellow guys in school. If you see a, a lady co cohabiting with a guy, a stu fellow student, in the name of school, uh, school love, and some of them they mess up themselves. Some ladies they go after a, a guys that give them gifts. They forget the most important thing of their life, which is their character. You see a guy that truly loves a lady, though living in a room. We see another guy that floats wealth on a lady, and the lady will forget about this one that truly care. And be following after the one that just, I just let me just give you the money, just eat, spend the money with me. You know, at the end, there is always regret. We have had experiences of ladies, you know, in relationships, some of them, what they after is the woman that a guy that can be able to give them phone, give them weak, and give them many things. So I don't have more to say because I'm not. In position of, to talk about relationship here. Yeah. What I want to say is that just take the advice that comes from or that came from men, uh, Judith. You know, you may not love Judith. You may not love your Edoche. You know, you may not love both of them because of how things happen. You know, how they uh, uh, became husband and wife. You know, but the truth is that. This lady said the truth. She said the truth. So if I leave, I would like you to watch this video. Make friends people that love God. Make friends people that have the fear of God in them. I like that. Make friends because if people you don't, that love God. They will destroy you. People that have conscience. Because if you have God in your if like you that. like, like that. so make friends with somebody that loves God. Just understand that there are consequences for every action you take. Of course. You can't go free from it. Either you're bringing curse to yourself or either you're hurting your family from it or just understand that whatever you do